Hey guys, Pete here with GIS Solutions, and today I'm going to go over the process of smoothing out a polygon in QGIS. So as you see my example here, you know, if I have some rough edges, we just really need to smooth out those uh, these 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 angles a little more to make it look a little more natural. What we could do is in your processing toolbox, if you search for smooth, so it's under vector geometry smooth tool. So what we're going to do is I'm using my test input layer, the iterations. Uh, so this is on a scale between one and 10. So the more iterations, uh, the higher number will result in more smoothing. Uh, the offset is basically how tight the smoothing uh, is going to be. Um, and then the maximum node angle to smooth. So this is going to prevent um, certain nodes from being smooth at different angles. It's a little confusing, but you could definitely play around with the numbers and and uh, give that a shot. I'll go and, go and show you an example here. So if I change the iterations to say five, leave the offset, uh, leave the maximum node angle. Now this is gonna create a temporary file. If you wanna go ahead and just save it off to somewhere, go ahead and go ahead and click this and to find a, uh, a destination for that. Otherwise, you could run it. And you can see right here, this is my temporary file, notified by this little icon. So already, you can see how smooth it is around those edges. And like I said, you could go ahead and play with this by changing the parameters, hitting this button here. So you could change like the iteration, just say seven, run it again. Now you can get another temporary file here, but at least you could keep going back and forth to see what the changes were, which one you liked and didn't like. Uh, going back to this maximum angle, say if I went to say 60, I don't know, we're just going to run that. You know, it looks like it's preserving some of the angles, but not others. Okay, so in another example, I'm going to just zoom over to this layer. Now, I grabbed this reservoir here out of OpenStreetMap, and I'll leave a, a link above about how to use this tool here, this quick OSM, to pull OpenStreetMap data right directly into your um, QGIS project. But anyway, so I did that, and say I wanted to smooth out some of these corners here. So again, I click onto this Vector Geometry Smooth tool, this is my layer, the natural iterations. Let's go and bump it all the way up to 10, leave everything else as a default and run. And already you can see in blue, which was my, I'll just go ahead and take these off. Okay, so blue is my original layer and my smooth layer. You can see some of these little finer areas are smooth now. So I hope you guys find this valuable. If you have any questions or comments, please leave those down below. And as always, please like and subscribe if you like this kind of video. And uh, thanks so much for watching.